Listen up. The students that have been coming up to work the resort on this side of the lake have been disappearing right and left. Local authorities didn't have a clue until our surveillance teams tapped into the winery house right there and taped everything you just saw. What about the cameras and the traps? Probably security. What? We suspect they're using the winery house as a cover and they're getting anyone who stumbles onto their scheme, whatever that is. My... This is Kelly. Ah, <laughs> kid. Come on, isn't she a little young? She's young. She's one of our best. She'll also be working inside. And remember, no one goes in until we get the signal from her. I want to know more about these traps. Yeah. That's one thing we've got going for us. How's that? One of our guys put an override on the camera cable unit here in the back hallway. Which means? Which means we have complete control of the cameras and the traps. But who operates that? They do. And who's that? I'm not exactly certain. Special operators from control. But we gotta work together on this one. Any questions? Let's rock and roll. Let's do it. Be careful out there, huh? And you. You keep your eyes open. We're all depending on you, especially Kelly. She should be there now. I'll switch you over. And good luck. can be, Tony. I was young once, too, you know. You are a very special boy. We both know that. But you must start doing your job. We all have to do our job. I know. We'll help your cousin with that. Yeah, it's about time. I'm sorry it didn't dawn on me. Yeah, I'll dawn on you if you don't get on the ball. I'm sorry. Oh, che cretini. So, what's happening tonight, Dad? Well, we have to bottle the two downstairs, and Sarah's coming in with six more tonight. Though. 
Has anybody seen my chamois bag? Which one? You got about a million of them. Back off, good face. You just better be glad I brought you along. The only reason you brought me along is because Mom made you. Shut up! Well, I can tell this is going to be fun. The problem is, Sheila and I might have to make a delivery. That's no problem. Tony and I can handle it. I'm not so sure. These have to go, too. Whoa, 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 what's this? This is a special vintage. Oh, Jeffrey, don't be so selfish. Think of the poor, starving augers. They're here. Good. Come down. I was so afraid you decided not to come. Oh, no way. I've been looking forward to this all week. Sarah, this is beautiful by the lake. Really? It looks like a swamp. Hi, Megan. Looks like a healthy bunch. Yes, it should be a good weekend. Too bad we must visit the Ogs tonight. I'd much rather stay here and enjoy our new guests. Now, Victor, we can't forget about the poor augers. Oh, you and your charity work is beginning to be much too much. Come, let's visit the girls. Oh, come on, everyone. I want you to meet my parents. Hi. So these are your lovely new friends from the shopping mall. Welcome to our little getaway. Father, I want you to meet Cindy. Hi. Ashley. Hi. Megan. Hey. Lisa. Hi. Her little brother Danny. What's up? And, oh, and Kelly. Nice to meet you, Mr. Martin. Please, call me Victor. Charming. And this is my wife, Sheila. Hi. Hello. What's the matter with you, anyway? I don't know. Bored, I guess. Bored. Well, that's gonna change pretty soon, huh? I mean, we're on our own tonight. So? So? You heard him. We got six. That's gotta be some kind of record. Yeah, well, I don't think you understand, Jeff. I'm not interested in that stuff anymore. Oh, the Open the door. Just a minute. How hard can it be to open a stupid door? Close the door. Can you close the door? How hard can it be to close the door? Come on, everyone. Let's go in the house. Okay. Oh, good. Right. Hey, Sarah. Who's that? That's weird, Eddie. He's just one of the neighbors. He's really cute now. Come right on in. Wow, great place. Oh, just leave your bags there for now and bring the groceries this way into the kitchen. Just set them down anywhere, girls. This is a beautiful house, Mrs. Martin. Well, please, just call me Sheila. He is really beautiful. Enchanté. What? Tu parles français, toi? Oh, no, thank you. Pity. This guy is really wigged out. <laughs> is this the freezer? Oh, no, 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 no. Not that one. The other one. What's this? Another refrigerator. Why is it locked? Danny! We'd all like to thank you very much for letting us come up this weekend. It's very nice of you. Our pleasure, my dear. <laughs> What's this? Oh, homemade cherry popsicles. Oh, great. We all have our own very special cravings around here. <laughs> hey, come on, everyone. Let's go down to the lake. Yes, right, thank you. Take care of oh, it. Oh, Sarah. 
Victor and I have to make a visit to the augers tonight. A delivery, actually. I am sure you and the boys can take care of everything here. I understand. Good night, Father. Good night, Dad. <laughs> Good night, sir. Good night. Good night. Bye, girls. Have fun. Bye. Come on, come on. Come on. Let's get out of here. That's just the basement. Let's go see the boats. Curious little bunch. What's wrong? Well, there's something about Kelly. Hmm, woman's intuition again, huh? huh. Oh, Victor, you monster. <laughs> Come on, let's go. We don't want to upset the augers. Hi, Eddie. Hi, Eddie. Nice of you to drop by, Eddie. Oh, and let us know when you want to die, Eddie. On your own tonight, boys. Right. Now, Jeffrey, make sure that Sarah gets them relaxed and separated before you begin, or they'll get away. Don't worry, Mom. It's all in the fingers. Good hunting. Do you really think we should be leaving them here alone? Why not? Well, do you think they can handle it? Of course they can. What could possibly go wrong? Come on, darling. The augers are waiting. All right. All right. Let's go and get everything ready. You really get a kick out of this stuff, don't you? Until I get back.
Smoke's clear. Jason. Come in, Jason. This is Mike. Jason's inside. I said no one in until we got the signal from Kelly. He thought he'd been spotted, so he went in to clean up. He clicked off before I could respond. It sounded routine. Collins, use decoy option and check it out. Roger. Mike, go around back and cover position three. I want him out of that house. Roger. brother, Jeff. I think someone's taking control of the system. We'll see if you can get it fixed. If not, we'll have to do it the old-fashioned way. I could take all weekend. I got plans. Yeah. Come on, everyone. I'll show you to your room. Okay. Lisa, I'm fine. Come on, Lisa. Lisa. What's going on? That girl looks exactly like Madeline. Oh, not that again. No. Not that again. Let's go, Studley. There's work to do. Sarah, your cousin's adorable. How old is he? Oh, older than you might think. You know, he doesn't talk very much. He never had a chance. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I The guest bedroom's up here, and they all share this bathroom. Hey, this is one pet. Great. Oh, now this is my favorite bedroom. Great. Sarah, this is really nice. I'm glad you like it. And what a great view. It really is. Hey, can I use this closet? Oh, sure, go ahead. Okay. Hey, Sarah, where's your bedroom? Oh, it's downstairs. You know, this place seems awfully large. Do you have a big family? No, it's just my parents, my brother, and me. But you never know who might drop in. You're not going to trash your face with this junk on you. Megan, it could be a lot worse. Oh, wow, you guys, this is the life. And what about Tony? Oh, Tony's just here for the summer. You know, I think he likes Ashley. Really? <laughs> yes. You can see it in his eyes. But he's wearing sunglasses. I mean, you can tell by his face. And his bod. <laughs> Yay! Sarah, 
What is this? Oh. oh cool. My father collects weird things. This is Collins. Here goes nothing, Chief. Just no heroics, huh? Count on it. I think we should give him the old Jamaican number, aren't you? And out. Come on, look at this stuff. You know, they should test this stuff on rats before they let people like you play with it. Right, and how would they do that, Megan? With a little rat. See, first you put him in a chair with a clouch. Oh, no, Miss Lisa. That was too tight. And then you find some powder and you put it all over his face. Oh, oh no, Miss Lisa. I, I can't breathe. Oh, I'll get it. Let's check it out. Did Megan invite somebody? So sorry to disturb you like this. So sorry to barge in. But I was wondering if uh, maybe you had seen my boat. Your uh, boat? My boat. Boat. Oh. <laughs> my boat. Ain't it a beauty? Hey, built it myself. <laughs> no, we haven't seen it. <laughs> ah, look at all the pretty girls. Is everything all right here? Hey? <laughs> that is good. Yeah. How about you, son? You seen my boat? Hey? Hey? those shades at night, eh? Yeah, well, uh, will there be anything else, sir? No, 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 no. Everything is all right. Yes, everything is fine here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, good night. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what was that all about? Something about a boat. Gee. Just, just try, try to relax. Try to stay calm, okay? Something is going on here. I don't know. I can feel it. Let me go check it out. Yeah, you check it. Do that. This is Collins, over. What's up? Everything looks okay inside, except no sign of Jason, over. Okay, okay, back to your position, and fast. We may have to move in soon. Roger.
you leave the body box unlocked? No. Well, it's unlocked. We have another problem. I found a tricord upstairs. A what? An auger tricord. Hey, yeah. you guys want some? <clears throat> oh, thanks. Thank you. Hey, Control, check this out. They have pictures of all the girls. Their heights, weights, and blood types on the back. You guys, oh, it's delicious. Oh, yeah. It's my creation. It's gross. Hey, where's Kelly? I don't know. I don't know, but she can have my ice cream. Let's go find her. This is so gross. Look at that. Right. Oh, you're right. They're here. Who's that? I don't know. It's just the kind of thing that would happen on our big night. <laughs> well, just... we better get the Ogs before they get the girls. Yeah. Well, look at this. It's a locket with a picture of a young woman. She looks just like Ashley. <gasps> oh, Tony. You always talk to yourself when you go through other people's belongings. Uh, Tony, what's going on around here? You got all these pictures of the girls and that locket. You'd never understand. Just stay out of it. I'm warning you. Tony, I'm not afraid of you. I'd like to know what's going on around here. Kelly, you all right? Yeah. Let's go outside. Come on, we gotta talk. Come on, we gotta get out of here. They're after us. Yeah, nice try, kid. Come on, let's get some fresh air. Right. I mean, his eyes were green. I'm gonna go get some. All right. We got big, big problems. What? The Augs are here. All right, stay with the girls. I'm gonna check it out. I'm serious, come on, I'll show you. Wait a minute, Danny, just calm down and tell us exactly what you saw. I went down in the basement and I saw these control rooms with monitors and buttons for traps. <coughs> what was that? Oh, now what? What was that? I don't know, it came from outside. I guess I was just surprised. What do you want? Well, I, I just wanted to... Is everybody all right? Hey, look, I don't think it's a good idea for you to be hanging around here at night. Why don't you just go home, okay? Wait, you're in danger. You seen those things too? What are they? Well, they're called augers, or augs, and they're like a vampire. You mean they suck blood? Yeah. Well, it's nothing personal. It's the only way they can keep alive. Most of them are so hungry, the skin keeps falling off their bones. That's why they dress so funny. <laughs> we gotta warn the others. Wait, some of them could be vampires, too. What can we do? Fight back. How? With these. What are they? Special laser guns. I made them myself. You just point and shoot. All right. Here, you take this one and go in the front, and I'll go around in the back. <laughs> That guy is definitely disturbed. Hey, let's go swimming. I'm gonna go upstairs and lie down. Yeah, I'm gonna go up too. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Well, how about you guys? Oh, no. Why don't you go ahead? Jeff and I have some cleaning up to do first. Some weekend. He's, he's just so weird. Yeah, he is. You know, the guy really scares me. Ashley, can I trust you? Yeah. Why? I'm working undercover, and you and the other girls might be in terrible danger. What do you mean? I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet, but I'd like you to stay in your room and be careful. I'm going to check out the rest of the house, okay? Okay. Tony! You scared me. Ashley, you must leave now. Why? There's no time to explain, but you're in grave danger. But Tony, I don't understand. You'd never understand. Just leave now. Ah! Hold it! You stay out of this! Don't make me use this, Tony. Did you really think that this stupid little toy could protect you? This is useless against us. Us? My family, my kind. 
You'd never understand. Are you okay, Ashley? Tony, what is going on around here? Just go now. Tony, why are you warning us? You remind me of a person I knew and loved long ago. But that could never be. Sarah's acting a little weird. A little weird? Come on, Cindy. Everyone around here is totally flipped out. This place is a disaster zone. Come on, Megan. It's not that bad. Yes, it is. Do you realize it's the first time I've had the car the entire weekend and I wind up in the middle of nowhere? It's embarrassing, Cindy. And Sarah said it was going to be an exciting weekend. Well, give it a chance. Tomorrow we'll go water skiing and the lake will be crawling with boys. That's if Lisa doesn't scare them all away. Let's go. Hi, boys. <laughs> Come on, Megan. Let's get something to eat. Cindy! I can't believe this. I come up here for fast boys and fast boats, and I get this. Hey, let's try one of these. Cindy, all you think about is food. Kelly, I'm so confused. What's going on? Oh, just relax, relax. Calm down. We're going to be just fine. This is Kelly. Come in. Over. Mike, this is Kelly. Come in. Roger, Kelly. This is Mike. Code red. I repeat, code red. Right. Okay, what's your 20? I'm upstairs, but the girls are all over the house. And Mike, be careful. These people are into something a lot worse than what we thought. I think they're vampires. What? Did you say vampires? Mike, I'm not kidding. Okay, okay, hold on. We'll tell leader we're coming in. Leader, this is Mike. Come in. Leader, this is Mike. Come in. Ah! Ah! Let's go down to the control room. Maybe Tony has seen the Augs. Gotcha. I'm serious. Eddie made these laser guns to fight off the Oggs. Oggs? We gotta tell everybody else. Follow me. <laughs> Wait! Don't shoot! It's me! This I don't fool him! <laughs> I'm one of the others. Okay. You check in there, and I'll check down there. Be careful. Doubt. I don't think you should be hanging around that weird Eddie. Definitely. No! Eddie, oh! you're making a mess. That tastes like blood. Yeah, right. <laughs>
Listen to me, okay? Listen. Now, I'm part of a special control attack team, SCAT. We have the whole house surrounded. We've taken control of all the traps and surveillance cameras in the house. There's one right there. Can they help us? Yes, they can, but you have to listen to me, do what I say, and when I say to do it. I think these might be vampires we're up against here. What? Vampires! <laughs> Something's very wrong here. Yes, the Ogs are here. I can feel them in the house. I'm afraid the Ogs aren't our biggest problem. What is it? I'm not quite sure. But I think we should enter the house through the back.
I sense something is wrong. I'm not quite sure what. What shall we do? Find Jeff and Sarah. I don't like this at all. I don't like it at all. Where are the girls? Let's look upstairs. Oh, you're back. Sarah, what is going on? The Augs are here. Oh, we suspected as much when they didn't show up for the delivery. They set us up. Oh, Victor, they're just hungry. Where are Jeff and Tony? They're downstairs in the control room. Leader, this is Swanson. Come in, over. What's going on out there? I'm at the point there is no sign of Mike, over. Wait a minute, there's a, a radio in the driveway. One of ours? It looks like it is, yes. Okay, that's it. All units go to Code Red. We're going in. Over. Repeat. All units to Code Red. I repeat. Code Red. Hit it. Hold it right there. Hey! Hold it! Hey, what is that thing? We're going in. Check the back. Charlie upstairs. Watch your step, guys. Someone else has taken control of the cameras and the traps. Who's that? What is the meaning of this? Please, that won't be necessary. Who are you? We're SCAT, Special Control Attack Team. You've got some explaining to do. Well, in that case, then, why don't we all go into the living room and get comfortable? Well, you just take it nice and easy, folks, because it's not been a good night for me, you dig? Are you all right, cuz? What's happening here? Hey, man, this place is crawling with monsters. We ran into a few of those things outside. I should inform you now, Mr. Martin. Your house has been under surveillance for some time. Really? A number of kids have been disappearing in this area, and most of them have been traced back to this house. Help me understand that, would you please, Mr. Martin? Well, this is all very intriguing. I really don't know where to start. Start by explaining the cameras and the traps. Well, I guess you'd call that charity. <laughs> charity? Well, in all fairness, all the credit goes to Sheila, my wife. It was actually her idea. Oh, no, darling, it was your brilliant craftsmanship that made all of this possible. Thank you. Get to the point. <laughs> Kello does. <laughs> what do you say? I don't like this dude, man. You see, Lieutenant, we were trying to help the unfortunate augers. Augers? Those are those things that were chasing us around the house trying to get our blood. <laughs> oh, Kelly, I think you're overreacting. What is an auger? A vampire victim who's been half bled and left there to die. Poor creatures have just enough blood to survive, but not enough to become vampires. Poor creatures? Those things are monsters. See? See? These people are crazy. It's a wicked <laughs> curse. Wandering about looking for blood, hoping one day to become a vampire. Ew! Vampires? You gotta be jabbing me. Let's cuff these freaks and drag them downtown. Hold it! I don't think you understand, Mr. Martin. But you're in serious trouble here. <laughs> <laughs> no, Lieutenant. I'm afraid it is you who doesn't understand. Jeffrey, are you all right? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. What's going on? Where's Tony? Control got him with the stair trap. Well, I guess we'll have to take care of this ourselves. That's it. Take him in. Get him, Dick. Oh, please. Hurt me.
She's getting away. I'll get her through the secret passageway. Let's go and get that phony. Right. Victor. After you, my dear.